Well, I just really, really proud of the guys. It's supposed to be live like this. I guess so. Okay. Really proud of the fellas. They, they did a great job of uh, executing the game plan. Offense, defense, kicking game. You know, we had to have it from each phase in order to win this game. TCU's got a good ball club. Uh, you know, it's been a tough couple of weeks. And uh, I'm just proud of their resilience and how they kept fighting and scratching and clawing. And, and I also appreciate it. I, I bet you I had 10 text messages for me. Loyal, Kubi, faithful. Tell them not to lose the, the faith. And uh, appreciate each and every one of you. We sent that and still believed in it. So I really appreciate that. Any questions? Willie, you get off to a, a fast start and we're able to sort of that that did that provide a comfort level or at least some some you know some some help. Well, it showed that we can score. You know, you hit score touchdown for a couple of weeks. Or, you know, and, and, and we hit the ball bounce our way a few times. We had a couple of fumbles in the first half. And we recovered it. Very fortunate. You know, and then. Uh, we hadn't had that in almost every week in every game that we played, I believe. We plus three turnover takeaway. Is that correct? Plus four. On my record, still intact. I've never lost a game. Never lost a game plus three or better. So uh, that's what we got to do in order to compete and win, you know, this conference. So just, uh, you know, and then I thought Zena did an outstanding job, you know, and then he gets hurt, and, you know, he cramps up, and Donovan comes in, just plays his tail off. And, and those guys, you know, I just probably both of them. They take a lot of crap. And, uh, you know, just the type of young men they are, they're able to bat back and, and, uh, and uh, just be so positive. They're both really good teammates and they support the heck out of each other. What went into the Dion starting, Willie? Was it the week of practice? Oh, the week of practice, pretty much. Yeah, a good week of practice. You know, we want to see how he did. We going to get him a few series. And he played really, really well. He started cramping up big time. And, you know, Donovan was ready. You know, a lot of guys would be little babies and not, not be ready to go. He came out there and played extremely well. And had some huge plays for us. Willie, in the first half when the offense was flowing, uh, how much would you attribute that to the tempo that we saw and also committing zero penalties in the first half? Well, that's, that's huge. We also had a bunch of penalties. You know, these first few games, a bunch of things. And so that helped us uh, big time, uh, just playing clean, you know, and, and uh, playing smart. And we preach it every day and preach ball security every day, but it didn't mean anything this players do. And they, uh, they, they did an outstanding job of playing clean and, and uh, had spectacular ball security. We're always working on takeaways. And, and uh, you know, AJ Halsey had a couple big interceptions. Uh, so it was, a, it was a really good team win. You mentioned that you had gotten like 10 text messages to keep the faith. Did you ever worry that your team wasn't going to keep the faith? You know, I, you know, I, I, I stay out of these guys pretty hard. You know, they, they, they you know, I got after them yesterday. I didn't think we had a very good walkthrough, and I was upset about it. And uh, you know, I just I told them, you know, we went out there, we, I came in the locker room. There's no music. There's no nothing. Guys are locked in. They're ready to go. You know, I thought to myself, we're going to play real good or real bad. We'll see that. But we're going to play real good. AJ's second interception, just like Josh came up through the ball, but the first one, it looked like a really good read on it. Yeah, it was, it was something we worked on all week. You know, they got in that particular formation, those splits. Uh, and with that coverage, he'd be the guy to get at me. He executed it, you know. Easier said than done. You know, they got a lot of stuff going on out there. AJ's one who did it. Great, great call by Coach Wood. And a great job of him executing the call. You mentioned it, the defense staying in Josh's face all night. I thought they did a super job. We got a you know, very good defense. Uh, we can roll some guys, uh, which helps you. Uh, you know, and we're going to go back and we're going to critique him. I don't think we tackle as well as we did, too. Some of that was TCU, though. Uh, great job by uh, the defense. Uh, you know, they, they shut him down. They gave up a little bit of uh, yardage, a couple of drives in the second half. But they didn't really quite to score. So, uh, so that was big for us. Time was running. Really, how essential do you think that uh, Zeon Chris run right before halftime more? Yeah, that's huge. To you. <laughs> I played call by Kevin Barbley, you know, and, and uh, 
is he on to tremendous athlete, great speed? How, how far was it? it? Must be 65? 71. 71, okay. Uh, great run by him. You know, and, and then in that formation, if you block it right, you know, the coverage they had is empty. There's going to be nobody in the middle of the field. He's got great speed and super giant. Well, the special teams have been a problem, but Jack comes in. Jack, Jack did over. great. He did great. You know, he he uh, had some uh, had, had some adversity he had to fight through early in the year. And uh, the same thing with him. Instead of being a little baby, he just kept his chin up and kept working hard and got his opportunity and took advantage of his opportunity, both with his field goals, extra points, and with his kickoffs. You know, some of those kickoffs were short. They must have been 4.3, 4.4 hang time. And that happened with an opportunity to get down the football field. And then you can't forget about uh, Garza and then Jake Sock, you know, with the snap in the hole. You know, that, that's also very important. But, and then great protection. One of the best things TCU does is their uh, extra point field goal block team. They really do a good job of creating pressure against you. Will he go into the open week, uh, much needed open week? What's the Sort of a message to the guys and stuff you can build off of? Yeah, yeah we can definitely build on this. You know, and, uh, but it's good. We're going to have a week off and jump into recruiting. And, and uh, hopefully, a bunch of recruits on the game tonight on ESPN National TV. You know, and, and uh, saw the coops playing good.